Amy from Doodle Dog Designs. I know a lot of us are very price conscious in our craftings, so I thought it would be interesting to compare the price of DMC Embroidery Floss to Valdani. I like to punch with three strands of floss, so today I'm going to compare the price of the DMC Embroidery Floss to Valdani three strand floss. I will calculate the price per yard of three strands of each type. I looked online at several stores to determine the current retail price of DMC Embroidery Floss. I found it at 56 cents at Hobby Lobby, 60 cents at Joann's, and 62 cents at Michael's. I will go with the median price of 60 cents. Each skein of DMC Embroidery Floss has 8.7 yards. Since each skein of floss has six strands, and we can separate the strands into two halves to get sets of three strands, that would give us 17.4 yards of three strands of floss. I did that by multiplying the 8.7 yards by two. So if we divide the cost of the floss by the yardage, then it will give us the cost per yard. So the cost per yard of the DMC floss is 3.4 cents. This does not account for any sales you might find. I purchased my Valdani floss at Snowflake Memories. It's an online store. I will link to them in the description below. They have it right now for $3.60 for a 29 yard ball of three strand floss. Again, dividing the cost by the yardage gives us the cost per yard. The cost per yard of the Valdani three strand floss is about 12.4 cents. I just found out that DMC also sells six strand embroidered floss in large cones in some of their more popular colors. It is sold by the pound and is approximately 450 yards. That's the equivalent of almost 52 skeins of six strand floss. That will give you 900 yards of three strand floss, by, again by separating the floss into two sets of three strands. And I found it on Amazon for $25.40. That works out to be 2.8 cents per yard. If you punch a lot with a certain color, buying it by the cone is certainly the cheapest method, but it's a large upfront investment. So overall, DMC is definitely a more cost-effective choice, but sometimes when you're crafting, it isn't just about the cost. Ease of use matters. You don't have to thread the needle as often when using the Valdani balls, but you can separate an entire skein of six strand DMC floss at one time. I will put a link in the description below for a video showing you how to do that. Ultimately, the most important aspect to me is how the finished project looks. I don't think this information will change how I punch. I will continue to use a combination of both DMC and Valdani floss depending on the look I want. I love the variations in the Valdani floss and the dimension it can give a project, especially by using it in the backgrounds. But a lot of times I just want a single solid color for an aspect of a design and for that I choose DMC. This helps keep the cost of my kits down for you. I hope you found this helpful. Be sure to click the like button and subscribe below. I'll see you next time. Bye.